is Sunny from Vegan Beauty Review and I wanted to quickly make a video about this new nail polish brand I just discovered. It's completely non-toxic and designed for little kiddos and it's called Kidlix. It's organic edible nail polish. And you guys, this is as non-toxic as it gets. It's made with organic acacia fiber, water, organic beet juice powder, organic corns, corn, did you hear that? Organic corn, <laughs> organic cornstarch and citric acid. And it says you need to refrigerate after opening. Like you guys, that's legit. These are fresh-ish ingredients. Uh, by the way, Kid Looks, this is their red shade. They also have a really pretty deep green and like a yellowy, orangey, carroty one. Um, so anyways, you're supposed to paint this on, let it dry for five minutes, and then remove with water and elbow grease. And uh, I tried this out on two nails. As you can see, <laughs> it, it looks bad. I mean, it has nothing to do with this. That's just me being like impatient. Oh, I've got to paint my nails. Um, and I'll demo this on camera in just a sec. Um, but anyways, most advertised non-toxic nail polishes, the 3, 5, 7, 10, 12, 80 million free <laughs> ones, still have toxic ingredients, um, especially if they have that funky stank smell. If it smells like ass, you guys, it's toxic. <laughs> um, but if it's water-based, or fruit and veggie base, you're pretty good to go. That doesn't mean that those non-toxic brands aren't doing awesomely because they're definitely taking out the most toxic ones and the ones that have been shown to have, that are hormone disruptors or can cause allergies or what have you. Like they're not good. So they're still doing good, but these people are doing great. <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and demo it for you. Um, this is what the formula looks like, you guys. It's kind of, kind of goopy. And I'm gonna go ahead and paint one of my nails on camera for you guys. <laughs> Sorry, I'm rocking the middle finger. Take no offense. I love you all. Oh, here, let me get a little more. So it's surprisingly uh, easy. Oops, I'm not even in frame. It's surprisingly easy to apply. And it is a really pretty vibrant red color. Okay, sorry you guys, I'm being sloppy. Whatever, you guys, you guys don't mind, right? Ta-da! So it's a really pretty color. Now for the taste test. Now this isn't like something you order to like chug at dinner time. Like you're not supposed to eat this. This is just intended to be uber safe. So if your kiddos happen to stick their pretty cute little paws in their mouths with wet nails or dried nails, you don't have to freak out because it's just veggies. Okay. I should make an S for Sunny, yeah? Whatever, did I do that backwards? <laughs> so it actually tastes really good. It um, kind of tastes like fruit leather to me. And it smells like fruit leather too, which is weird because it only has uh, beets. It, it almost smells and tastes like there'd be berries in here, like a strawberry, blueberry blend. But it's just beets, yo, and it tastes really good. Um, I would definitely smear that on some toast. <laughs> so anyways, Kid Licks Organic Nail Polish. Um, I love that they're making, their brands out here making interesting and innovative non-toxic nail polishes. I would not wear this per se because it's a little, it, it dries like fruit leather, <laughs> if you will. Um, but I would definitely, you know, I was just thinking, oh, I could give this to uh, a friend of mine who has a little girl but I just, I totally stuck my tongue on it, which is like grody, and then I put it back in. Talk about double dipping, right? <laughs> uh, so yeah, I don't know what I'm gonna do with this bottle. But anyways, I think they're a cool company doing cool things. And if you have little munchkins, I'd love to know what you guys use on their nails. I have two little boys, so I don't know. I don't, I don't paint their nails, but maybe I could. I don't know. Um, that's it for now. I'll see you guys later. Please give this a thumbs up and subscribe and um, let me know. Oh, there's a really beautiful cloud outside. Can I show you? <laughs> I don't know. Can you guys see that gigundo? What is it? Cumulonimbus cloud? Whatever. Okay. Anyways, let me know what you guys use on your kiddos' nails and what your favorite non-toxic nail polish is. And I'll see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.